Cookie had her babies yesterday, or actually early this morning. And she had a beautiful litter of five, just like the size of the litter she came from. It's kind of interesting how mothers sometimes have the same size litters as what they were born in. Anyhow, I got three boys, and I know Cookie. You did such a good job. She did it all by herself. She went in the box. I had fallen asleep in my recliner out in the living room. And I came in my bedroom this morning. They were all cleaned and nursing and doing great. She is an experienced and pro at being a mother. Hi, baby. Yes, your babies are beautiful. Yes, they are. Just let me take a little video of them. And I'll let you have them back. Yes, we have a little cream and white boy. Mostly a van. He's got some cream spots on his body. But he's mostly a van. I know I'm not hurting your babies. I know my hands are cold. And then we have another cream and white boy. He's also very cute. Have some cream patches on his body, but it's kind of hard to see because he's mostly white. Father BJ is a blue and white van, so. Um, and Cookie's father was a cream silver, so that's where the Duluth comes from. Then we have another third little boy. Another cream and white. Wow, got a lot of dilutes in this litter. That's it's a recessive gene, so that's kind of surprising. Stop. Not surprising since the mother is a carrier and the father is a blue and white. And I'm hoping because they have so much white that they're going to be blue-eyed like their mother and their father. And that's there's a very good chance of that. And then we have a beautiful little dilute Mike. She's got a little zigzag tail, so she might be a long hair. BJ, the father, does carry long hair, and since Cookie is a long hair, there's a very good chance that half of this litter will be long hairs. And sometimes when they're born with a slightly longer tail like that, it's because they're going to be long hairs. Again, she has enough white that she might be blue-eyed too. And then we have a beautiful pattern Mike Harlequin. Oh my god, is she cute? Cute, 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 cute. Got lots of spots. And that's because Cookie's heavily colored and has a solid mother. So we're supposed to get 25% heavily colored cats, even bred to a van. So the genetics are perfect on this litter. Three boys, two girls, one dilute me, Kay. She doesn't feel like she's going to be a long hair. The boys feel like they might be long hairs, but they're just a couple hours old, so it's really hard to tell until about three or four weeks of age. But this is the litter. Okay, Cookie, I know you want your babies back. This is clean bedding. We're going to put them back for you. Just want to let you know Cookie had her babies, and this is what she had.